Hello, and in this episode, I'm going to talk about healthy escapes. There's times in our life where there can be, where we feel stuck in life, where we haven't improved our lives in a long time, or we've put in a lot of effort and we seem to be going nowhere. Maybe that's true, and if that is true, you have to change your methods of going about it, and especially if it's an entrepreneurship or something of that nature. A lot of people are afraid to try to change because they're afraid they can't make it. But sometimes, if um, the frustration is enough or the pain of where they are is enough, they can't stop trying to improve it better improve than and try to improve than just surrender. Surrender is not the way to go. It won't lead to um, you feeling fulfilled and it'll lead to burnout or further burnout or complete burnout. Not a good thing. But nevertheless, healthy escapes. Well, examples of that could be... Um, Playing a sport, I play pool, competing in pool. I feel alive when I compete. When I'm not competing, I feel eh. But that's one example. Another one could be meditation. I meditate in my own way. I started a new form of meditation. Don't do it every night. And that is um, working on a puzzle. Another healthy escape I like to compete is fantasy football. Another healthy escape is working on my goals. That's a better healthy escape because it is something that can actually turn into something. Another healthy escape is networking. Another healthy escape is new hobby with I have with a friend. It's going sailing and learning about sailing. Another healthy escape is um, working on these YouTube videos. So there's many healthy escapes. Um, the one I don't do because I'm so uh, about working on my goals is to get into another career is uh, going to the gym. I have a hard time with that one. Because the, there's certain other things I want more. But, oh, I got to do it. But having a lot of trouble with that one. But nevertheless, healthy escapes are important. Especially if you feel like you're not in a good place in your life. So, But it's better to actually work on things that will lead to something and build something instead of just having healthy escapes. Then uh, on their own will only make you feel better for temporary periods, but it's solutions are better than escapes, but escapes are better than nothing. So nevertheless, healthy escapes. If you're interested in this topic, um, Leave a comment down below, and I hope you're doing well, and let's try to reach dream fulfillment, myself and all of us. Thank you, and may your dreams come true. Keep fighting for them. I have. It gets hard sometimes. Goodbye.